Hello guys, I'm back, Vic here of US Market Biz and for today I'm going to show you a very high potential coin and I'm also going to show you its website. So without further ado, let's proceed to the coin, alright? So the name of the token is DAMCoin. So currently it's ranked number 723 in coin market cap and um, the price of DAV coin right now is 0 0.004994 and the market cap is 2,270,460 US dollars. The volume is 163,430 US dollars. The circulating supply is 454,636,709 DAV. The total supply is 1,380,276,938 DAV. Okay, so here's the cha chart of DAV. And you can also um, get this token at these exchanges. So they are Bitforex, Hit, BTC, LA Token, Bilaxi, and Didex. And you can also follow their Twitter account uh, named at Dav Network. Right? So right now, um, they just tweeted that today. Events like these make it clear that the future of transportation is already here and DAV is the cutting edge. We're proud, we're proud to be in Tel Aviv, one of the cities leading this fundamental revolution. So as you can see, uh, this is their latest tweet. Okay, so let's go to their website. So you can access their website by clicking um, in this on uh, the website link in coin market cap and you can also write directly uh, dav dot network right so dav means decentralized autonomous vehicles so it is the coin of transportation it's a blockchain based transportation protocol enabling a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer global transportation network so they are building a decentralized infrastructure to revolutionize the transportation industry on the blockchain. So this is very nice. As you can see, here's some videos. So the first video uh, states the DAV overview. So you can watch this at their YouTube channel or here at their website. And also is the first Australian company to utilize DAV protocol for shipping and logistics. You can also watch it here or in their DAV YouTube channel. Okay, so you can also join them at their tweet, um, at their social media accounts. Okay, so DAV's protocols allow anyone to utilize transportation services or put their own manned or autonomous vehicles on the network, creating a decentralized peer to peer transportation ecosystem. So, what blockchain means to transportation today? So, decentralized ride hailing convenient city transportation and decentralized manned deliveries okay so what blockchain means to transportation tomorrow so autonomous drone deliveries autonomous carriers and autonomous ride sharing okay so what the DAO protocol um, here's the what it enables so the verify a verifiable ledger of circle data from service providers man or autonomous vehicles and users needed for insurers and third parties a completely decentralized system that isn't controlled by any government, bank, or company. A global payment standard between vehicles and their supporting infrastructure. A built-in smart mission contract which enables trust-less cooperation between multiple vehicles and service providers. So those are the four. So DAV, the technology. So DAV is a framework of open source software, open source hardware in the free decentralized marketplace where anyone can buy and sell autonomous transportation services. So the technology consists of three major components. So the first one is the centralized discovery, the second one is communication protocol, the third one is trustless cooperation tools. So the centralized discovery um, allows autonomous vehicles to discover each other, as well as service providers and clients around them. DAV implements a centralized node discovery using a peer-to-peer -peer protocol that does not rely on a central server. 
Instead, nodes are listed in a distributed hash table, which can be accessed in an extremely efficient way. Okay, so the communication protocol so defines a library of standardized communication protocols for various transportation scenarios. This communication is divided into two groups. And the first one is on blockchain communication, which is done directly by calling smart contracts and through events emitted by those smart contracts. The second one is off blockchain communication done peer to peer using DAVs protocols. Okay, so the third one, uh, the third technology is trustless cooperation tools. So trustless cooperation between buyers and sellers of transportation services is achieved using a series of specialized smart contracts. These smart contracts enable multi-party contracts between buyer, seller, and we need it, between arbitrator, insurer, and others. These contracts are tied directly to the DAV token, guaranteeing financial resolution for transactions between multiple parties without requiring any pre-established trust. All right. So the uh, let's check um, what they're they've built so far. So let's check the protocols that they've built. Okay. So these are what they've built already. Okay. So the community built modules. So the first one is drone charging network. So it connects drones and charging stations on an open network where they can buy and sell charging services using DAO tokens. So the current status is a DAO Alliance member has been available a network of five charging stations in northern Italy. These stations offer charging services through the DAO network in exchange for DAO tokens. Okay, so as you can see, here's a sample of uh, the charging network in the app. So you can view where to charge, right? So the next one is drone flight planning. So DAO connects drones and service providers along them allowing them to buy and sell flight planning services on the DAO network using DAO tokens. So the current status for this is integration with the DAO Alliance member has been completed with the service. I mean, the service is currently offered in Nevada, USA. So right now it's in Nevada, USA. So the drone will follow the waypoint. So there's a waypoint and you'll easily know when will the drone arrive and when, where is the drone? Where is the drone already? Okay, so right, so here it is drone flight planning. The next one is drone missions app. So, missions is the first app to app built to showcase the DAV ecosystem. It connects users looking to ship packages with autonomous drones. Users request drone services, drones bid for those services, and trustless cooperation is enabled by using the blockchain. Integration with the first drone partner, Copter Express, is underway. So the DAV CLI testnet, uh, so this is their command line interface tool, was built to make developing applications and services that interact with DAV a much more pleasant experience. It allows developers to easily run a local testnet containing DAV contracts, generate identities secured by private and public keys, and register them on blockchain. This allows anyone to easily scaffold new projects or modify an existing one to interact with DAV and more. So the current status is fully functioning testnet and identity generation already used by foundation projects. Work on connecting the registration functionality with an identity smart contract is in progress. Next one is a Dev Developer Portal. So, their Developer Portal incorporates API documentation, communication protocols, and instructions for running in their command line interface. So local testnet on Block Explorer. So, the current status is multiple communication protocols written, and a user guide for their CLI tools is now available. So, here's the Developer Portal. The next one is Block Explorer. So, their Block Explorer allows users to explore local Ethereum testnets. This eases development and debugging for developers building apps and services on top of DAV. So work is underway to package the Block Explorer, enabling it to launch automatically from the DAV CLI tools. So the next one is, a, is the Missions Control. So Mission Control serves as the, the, the directory and communication layer that connects and keeps track of vehicles, users, and services. So the current status is fully working for running simulated environments with drone deliveries currently being expanded to support the vehicles of their first partners. So the next one is my favorite. So one of my, my favorites, so that's so the autonomous boat. So here's the boat. 
So Dev and the California Maritime University are developing an autonomous boat called Nemo. So when launched at the end of September, Nemo will be tasked with collecting oceanographic measurements in the San Francisco Bay. When Nemo runs low in energy, it connects with the Dev network, purchase and pay for charging services with the Dev tokens, and char after it charges, head back to sea. Nemo will demonstrate true autonomy by spending money to take care of its own needs, allowing it to operate independently for long periods of sea. So the current status of this is boat is ready. Work on the onboard computer and its final integration with the DAB network is in progress, right? So the next one is also one of my favorites. So it's a search and rescue robot. So DAB and Australian robotics prototyping platform are developing a POC involving an autonomous robotic rover that will perform drone search and rescue missions. The rover will bid for missions to locate drones that have lost contact with their owners, go to the last known location, and then using its onboard lighter and computer vision, find them and send back to their coordinates. So the current status is Rossbot's computer vision algorithms are being updated to support identifying drones. Those are the community both modules um, built under the DAV protocols. As you can see, there's a lot already. So the first one is drone charging network. The second one is drone flight planning. The third one is drone missions app. Uh, next one is DAV CLI and testnet, DAV developer portal, block explorer, mission control, autonomous boat, and the search and rescue robot. So there's a lot already. So as you can see, it's very, very nice. And if you're fond of, you know, um, drones and technology like this one, so this is the right token for you, uh, the uh, right technology for you, right? So here's the roadmap. As you can see, they've, already, they've really completed all of the uh, previous ones, right? So their white paper is also here, and also their team of advisors. So as you can see, their team of advisors are from renowned companies like General Motors, NASA, Ethereum, Equinix, SAP, FAA, UPS, Bancor, IBM, Cisco, and Ford. Okay. So here's the, their main team uh, that consists of their CEO, CDO, CCO, and of course their developers and everyone else, right? So since DAV is an open source software, um, there's also a lot of open source contributors. So as you can see, here's some of them. So if you want to become one of them, so you can also um, send, right? Okay. So send them that you're one of the so you're one of the open source contributors also. Okay. So the DAV Alliance. So they also have their DAV Alliance here. So as you can see, there's a lot of DAV Alliance members already. So let's check their Alliance mem Alliance member page. So the Alliance members page and the Alliance member page is where you can find the form that will become that you will fill out if you want to become an Alliance member. So this is the form. Okay, so let's go back to the top. So the DAV Alliance Coalition. The DAV Alliance is a coalition of enterprises, innovators, and leaders in the transportation industry. Their purpose is to bring together members of the transportation industry so that they may collaborate on innovation and standards for a global decentralized network. So these are the benefits of being an Alliance member in DAV. So shared knowledge and influence of so members of the DAV Alliance benefit from shared knowledge and experience amongst members, but also gain value from an interest group that can have a greater ability to influence policy and mindshare regarding autonomous vehicles across jurisdictions. The second one is blockchain technology and the DAV protocol. So access to the latest technology innovations, trends, and learnings within the blockchain industry from leading technologies, experts, and strategists access to the blockchain applications and the DAO protocol specific to the future of transportation. All right, so they're building a decentralized commons for all. So DAO Alliance members will be at the forefront of the Z of centralized transportation and autonomous vehicle adoption by the mainstream. It is their goal to help bring this remarkable technology to the world and to share the benefits and successes with their members. So they invite you to become a part of their global vision where access to safe, efficient mobility is available to all and where anyone or anything can be moved anywhere with just one token. So these are the Alliance members already. So there's a lot. Okay. 
So that's the Alliance page. So here's the invitation to their Telegram group. So you can also join there to ask your question, to, so that you can freely ask your question, uh, question there. Okay. So here's um, also their DAO um, YouTube channel. You can, f you can subscribe there. As the their YouTube channel is also updated from time to time. Some facts about DAB, right? Okay. So who is behind DAB? Alright, so this is the DAB website. So as you can see, there's um this is very, very nice and DAV coin, right? So as you can see at their chart, and of course you can view DAV, uh, their technical, the technical analysis of DAV at our preferred currency news newsletter spreadsheet. So subscribe at preferred currency news for fifteen dollars a month or one hundred eighty dollars a year. So don't forget preferred currency news and of course DAV coin, right? So. Before I go, I just want to say that I'm not a financial advisor and everything I say here is not a recommendation for you to buy and sell using crypto. So everything I say here is okay, so you must always do, everything I say here is just my opinion, okay? So you must you must always do your own research for deciding for yourself. Right? So please don't forget to like press the like button and subscribe. Okay, so this is Vic once again, signing off.